Yeah, baby, this is the back end over here. <laughs> All right, let's go. tacos where the music is loud and this place is humongous and it's busy yeah. and you can either go to the table I mean over there and order it or you can sit by the bar area and they uh, have servers all right so let's see what uh, this place has to offer you got to speak a little louder, baby. I know. <laughs> Did you know that this place originated in Texas? Why am I not surprised? Yeah, this place is from Texas and stuff. And now it's out. First place I've ever seen anyway that I know from Lakeland. But they got some good stuff. I guess we'll start off with an appetizer. And the prices aren't bad. All right. All right. Let's wait for our server. Okay. Right now, it's only three locations. Brandon, Lakeland, Temple Terrace, and it's coming soon to Riverview. All right. So they let you have fuzzy cups, dude. Yeah. They put them in the to-go cups. I wonder if these are free refills. We never did ask. So they're not free refills. I don't know. Well, right, but they're putting them in the fuzzy, so don't sip too much until we ask. And then we know. But this place has an area inside there. And then it has a bar area and then on the other side. <laughs> and like the lady said, around the bar area they serve you. Outside of the bar area, it's not full service. Uh-oh. I thought you were hungry. You sound tired. <laughs> Alrighty. Right now we're gonna order appetizer. We're gonna get the chips and guacamole. Okay, BB, you solved the mystery of the refills. They're free refills. You take the cups home, and what happens? When you come back, when you get them refilled here, it's only 99 cents. Yeah, so you bring those cups back. It's 99 cents. That's not bad. Yeah. I'm telling you, dude, this place wants you to come back. I mean, right now we got guacamole, chips for appetizer. You got the bowl, and I got some enchilada and tacos. Sounds good, because we're starving. <laughs> and it's not bad pricing, because everything looked like it was $7.99. Yeah, it's not bad at all. No, no. All right, well. All right. What? What are you going to say? No. <laughs> All right. I lost my train of thought. Alrighty. <laughs> oh, BB. It's going in for the dip. Damn straight. <laughs> What's on it there? Spicy me. Kind of smells like Doritos. In a way. You know? Guacamole looks good. I mean, I love avocado. Why? Yeah. All right, is it spicy or what? Yeah. No? There goes BB scooping it up. <laughs> All right, you eat. I'm going to eat too. Okay. Make sure you're talking loud. They got loud music here. <laughs> This place has a lot of tequila. <laughs> a lot of tequila. 
especially over there. What's the name of those bottles? Oh, I'm sorry, right there. And they got one right over there with the dragon. All right, well, everyone's gonna be walking in front of us. Yeah, they are. But it's a lot of tequila. How's it taste? Excellent. It tastes corny. I guess I've never had corn chips before. Is that what they are, corn? Right. But it tastes pretty good. Even with that, yeah, even with the sprinkle thing on it. And fresh, too. All right, you keep eating. Eat, me, me, eat. Okay, I will say this. That seasoning there. It's perfect. It's got spice. Like a kick to it. But it's not a burning kick. Now the guacamole. In my personal opinion, I think these chips would have been good with the... Uh, with the salsa or the cheese I'm just saying for me I mean I love avocados but I just felt like the guacamole was dry and I guess I was just looking for something wet but I'm not taking away from it I'm not saying the guacamole is not good I'm just saying today right now I just you know I think it would have been good these chips would have been good with something wet the cheese and the salsa. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Righty. That's not refried beans. That's the what now that she said? Enchilada. No, no. That's the enchilada with the rice mm -hmm. and the taco. And you got the bowl. Is that steak or brisket or what is it? It's like beef. Oh, my God. Smile, dude. <laughs> I can't believe you're gonna eat that. Watch. <laughs> eat, baby. Eat, eat. No, but these are, this is something else. It's like a soup or something. Navy beans. Right, pinto beans. Bacon. Right. But Cilantro. That thing smells good. I'm serious. That's right. And you're missing the one ingredient in that. What? Beer. All the beer. I can taste the beer. There's beer in there. Yep, she's right. So it's got bacon, pinto, cilantro, cilantro with beer. And that shit tastes good. Oh, no doubt. <laughs> Did you go there? Yeah. You know what? The dip, the chips and that would have been good to dip in for me anyway. But the guacamole would have been good mixed with the rice or my enchilada right here. And you're mixing your stuff up right there. Mm -hmm. That's a bowl. Lift that bowl up real quick. No, no, like, holy smoke, dude. <laughs> Mix, BB. Mix. <laughs> How's it taste, BB? Oh, I'm sorry. I'll wait till after you swallow it. But my beer bean thing there, dude, that's 100% on point. And I don't even like beer like that. But it's like the taste is in my nose and everything. Kind of like that Guinness place we went to. Oh, is that for me? Yeah. Oh, okay. Mmm. That tastes like the Puerto Rican. The Puerto Rican, if you go to Puerto Rico, they make it chicken, pork, or steak, or beef. It's called, uh, I can't remember, Caballero? No, not Caballero. I think it is called a Caballero. But that's what it, it's something like that. It's a bowl. That tastes good. Damn good. Kind of wish I would have got that. <laughs> But I didn't even start eating mine, so I'm gonna start eating mine. And I still have my taco. And that's all $7.99. And BB's eating my food. <laughs> that's what I did mine, I mixed mine. 
and mine stays pretty good. Just one fault to it. The rice is sticky. When you go to a real Mexican restaurant, the rice is fluffy. You know what I'm saying? But So when you mix it in, it kind of mixes different. Like, you know, because the sauce will go through a fluffy rice, then a sticky rice. But it's good. I mean, it's, it's good. Okay. Right, that's a brisket that I got. Right? And then this is the pork. Oh, no, no, that's the brisket. And that was beef. Yeah, okay. And you got the steak or whatever, or beef. You did good today, dude. Beef fajita. Yeah, you did, real, you did real good. That was like $7.99 or something, or $8.99. Son of a gun. And you could taste everything. Guacamole's good in that one, definitely. And the cilantro. There's a lot of cilantro in here. Yeah. I mean, I love cilantro, so. Mm -hmm. But yeah, fuzzy taco is on point. It's on point. This hit the spot, dude. And we're here. It's around lunchtime. Okay. Drink it up, dude. Drink, baby. Drink. <laughs> Eat your bowl. <laughs> if you dare, the black one is hotter than the red one. Yeah, it's habanero. Yeah. That's butt burning. <laughs> and, I, and I was saying that this food is so good that even back there where the employees are, back there, I mean, even they're eating. <laughs> I mean, so you know if your employees are eating this stuff, it's good. It's real good food. Well, Texas did it right. <laughs> As BB swallows the food. Damn, dude. <laughs> Don't get the beer soup. Get your fuzzy drink. Hi, right, BB, and the final taco. Brisket. Let's see if I did it right this time. Go ahead, try it. You try it. <laughs> well, you take a bite first, and then I'll take a bite after. Well, we gotta see. We gotta make sure, dude. I think there's a jukebox here that these people are playing the music. All right, as we give BB a second to swallow and her taste buds go popping, I will then take a bite of it now. Okay, BB, what'd you think of everything? That was great. Even that last one, the brisket was good. Uh -huh. On point. Yeah. Very flavorful. They definitely use a lot of ingredients. Yeah, they do. Yeah. They're starting to get packed. Mm -hmm. So this is kind of like a bar, taco restaurant. Yeah. Like I said, I guess that's how they do it in Texas. You got the TVs to watch sports. You got your bar, you got your eating, you got your service area. And we're being served by a bartender. Yeah. Big difference. And this place and some other place that we have went to. Yeah, we're not going there again. Yeah, but I'm just saying, like, this is, we're being served by a bartender. Mm -hmm. Who, they're making their money and she's hustling and everything. And giving us information, spending time and ex to explain. explain and, everything. and if it's your first time, making sure they go over everything with you. Very decorative and big. Now we wait for the bill. And the soup of the day is tequila. <laughs> this area here is where the dogs are. Yeah, you can bring your dogs here too. They have an area for the dogs. Yeah, go in there and look. You'll see. <laughs> That's where you can feed your dogs and stuff. 
Hi, BB, what'd you think of it? I like it. Yes. Really good food. She told me if you download the app, it's like those reward points. Okay. Uh, but if you down, if I download it, and then you download it as a friend, then we both get free appetizers. So for every friend you have downloaded that you send the app to, and they say it's from you, then all of you get free appetizers. So it's better to, you know, husband, wife, boyfriend, girlfriend, you download, but then you say, I have a friend. And then you just keep it on. And the bill was 29 and change. Tip five, so it's 30. And I'm gonna say this, but when we went to barbecues and we spent like 40 bucks, I was like, holy cow. We came here and we spent 30 bucks, but we got service and I'm amazed. Like, I'm not, like 30 bucks is good, what we just ate. That was a lot. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, the, the, that was worth it. it I, the price did not shock me or nothing. Yeah. The atmosphere is great. People are all friendly. Yeah, but I think that's what it is. You know, it's really big place and stuff. So, all right, and it goes. And I mean, it goes way back there. We're gonna. I want to go around that corner real quick. But we'll be back here again. Yeah, yeah. But when we leave, let's just go out that way real quick. But uh, yeah, this is worth it. Fuzzy Taco is definitely worth it, man. Absolutely. I mean, they're not rushing you to go or, or nothing. No. All right. Well, that's our next video. Yeah. Peace, and the next shot will be the back area of this place. Goodbye.